Very miscellaneous commercial fishing day. Started off the day trying to troll for king mackerel with spoons, and you'll watch us do that for a little bit. And then we shifted gears to some bottom fishing, and that's what we did for the rest of the day. Just bounced around, fished a couple different areas, and fished for a couple different species of fish. Caught a lot, but we had to catch a lot in order to uh, make the day worthwhile. So, hope you enjoy. So this would actually be an ideal size of king mackerel if you found a lot of them and could catch a bunch of them. They're worth a little more when they're smaller. That's why I said that, but unfortunately there were not very many of them around. Oh, we're on! Oh boy! No. Yeah, so the king mackerel trolling did not last very long because we were only catching false albacore besides that one, and false albacore are worth almost nothing. Right here you got Wyatt in the back cutting up a false albacore for bottom fishing bait. Uh, he's just kind of going to make some cross hatches on that thing, and then when you go to take the fillet off of the side of the fish like you would normally fillet a fish, all the pieces are pre-cut. makes it really nice for when you need a bunch of pieces of bait when you're uh, small hook fishing. Yeah, good ringtail bite. Target species. Oh, <laughs> I got my, I got my friend. bass. There you go. What you got? I think I know what you got. Whatever it is. And here we have an out of season gag grouper. Pretty nice one there, but yeah, they're out of season, so he had to go back. I hooked a lot of big sand tiger sharks this day, and you can see right here, it looks like I hooked the bottom, but then the bottom's kind of moving, I'm kind of pulling on it, and this one luckily came off and I didn't lose any of my rig, but yeah, the sand tigers were definitely out and about on this day. Party foul. Oh, man. You see the progression? 
progression the progression of the spot when you start catching non-desirables like this bank sea bass it is time to make a move Gummies. <laughs> you are kidding me! I told you I felt the one hook pull free and then the other one caught him. A, a three hook rig right here. They are quite present. I'd rather have red snapper than them. <laughs> yeah.
Wyatt got a good thing. I did very poor. Wyatt. Come on. the hold the sinker right into them. Two bees over there. On skin. Four skin. Three. Yeah, I've been getting a lot. Wow. Ooh. Yeah. Good if Oh, yep, I got him. Right. He's spirited. One. 
that shark took my whole rig. So when I rigged back up with a new leader, I just put a small jigging spoon on there at first. And I decided to drop that down there and see what I could come up with with that. I hadn't really been catching that many uh, vermilions. I'd mostly been catching trash fish. So I wanted to see if I could maybe make a little difference in my average. So I had tried doing just your normal jigging, uh, snapping the rod tip, and that didn't work. And then you saw I got that bite when I was just reeling that bait towards the surface. And sometimes a good thing to do is just to let it hit the bottom and then wind it back up and just repeat that instead of snapping the rod tip. Sometimes that retrieve, moving that bait way up through the water column, gets those fish to go. Figured them out. They want it on the retrieve. Just start reeling it toward the surface. It's a nice one too. The other one I lost felt bigger. Yeah, <laughs> the quality bees are on the jig. He was going nowhere.
<laughs> you never know. That's what got my last one. Over and bleed that Spanish. Yeah. That's a nice one. That's a big B right there, son. I'll just be hooked on this fish. <laughs> I have two. Would you like them bled? Yeah, Damn, sure. The price tastes pretty good. They're here. Crazy. Jig bite. box has been tainted. just fouled up is all. Oh, what is this? There's, there's a name, Soapfish. It's my first one of those. Can they stick you? Yeah. 
<laughs> Where'd you Take catch that? Bonita. I do believe I have a Bonita. On the bottom, my favorite. I think I have a Bonita. my first scam. Caught him by his tail. Caught him by his tail. Why we released. Yep. It's a pretty fish. Mr. Vermilion Snapper. That's what it feels like. How about a uh, rougher? Doesn't feel like a jack to me. Oh, it is a jack. Little small Almaco. Twenty inches. I know recreational they don't have a size. I would say he's definitely twenty. 